Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Esoteric Atlanta. Of course, my name is Bryce. Wow, what a week this has been. For the first time in a very, very long time, I have actually felt pretty hopeful about the future in like hopeful in a realistic way, like in a grounded way, not like in a conspiracy type of way, but in like, okay, now we have a plan. Now we can actually do this. Now, before we get into the conversation at hand, couple of things. First and foremost, I'm so excited. I have now started looking into TikTok. I have had a TikTok account for a while, but I was not active on it. And I've been really looking into creating TikToks, um, like three minute little videos over some of my deeper dives to put on TikTok. And I would super appreciate it if you would give me a follow on TikTok, because it does help because we do get into some trouble sometimes. So it's nice to have our brand name out there on all sorts of different platforms. Now, it is under Esoteric Atlanta on TikTok. There will be a link down in the description box below. I have not connected it to the YouTube channel yet. I'm still trying to get my head around how to film with a green screen. So eventually I will connect it to the channel, but please go ahead and if you're on TikTok and if you want to, please give me a subscribe over there. Um, also, this conversation that you are about to, this episode that you're about to watch is on the other platform. Um, because uh, we probably do not have popular opinions for this platform. And so, um, as you guys know, the link is down in the description box below. But before you flip over there, before you flip over to the other one, um, as I said yesterday, I'm going to say this a couple of times just because it pisses me off, and I thank you guys for letting me know, but there's not a whole lot I can do about it. Unfortunately, part of this industry, part of this world, we do get scammers a lot. And um, there's not a whole lot that we as content creators can do about it. And thank you to Alicia Gee for contacting me and letting me know that there is another Rumble account. It's called Esoteric Atlanta Official. That is not me. Even though they have my picture, it is not me. I posted it on my community tab as well as on Instagram. Um, I can't find them on Rumble. I think they've blocked me. So um, I am just Esoteric Atlanta. I would never call my channel Esoteric Atlanta official. Um, if I did open up another Esoteric Atlanta account, it would probably be here on YouTube and it would probably be Esoteric Atlanta 2.0. Rumble is my backup. So I'm probably never going to have two Rumble channels, right? So just be really careful, guys. Again, it's super annoying. I wish there was more that I could do about it or that anybody else that's had this problem can do about it but unfortunately it, we're limited and i you know the reason why they do this is they either want to download our videos and play them on their channel for the money which pisses me off because it's our hard work but they also might create um a channel because they know that i have good faith with you guys um and they will probably start to contact you guys asking you for money are asking you for a private phone conversation and I'm never going to do that. Okay. Um, some of these people will go and post phone numbers claiming it's my phone number. It's not my phone number. I'm not that stupid as to post my private phone number openly on the internet. And I would never do that to anybody else either. No matter how much I didn't like a person, I would never do that because that is incredibly cruel to dock somebody in that way. Um, just be careful. Again, any type of, of services rendered, like any type of money that comes through this um, esoteric Atlanta is going to be coming through like services rendered. You know, like it's going to be coming through um, using discount codes through sponsorships for a product, which is going through a different business. Or if you're doing any type of yoga stuff, that's going to be coming through a business. Like you need, there's going to be services rendered. If you know, if you are, I, I, we have a Patreon account. And I love my patrons and producers. It's strictly volunteer. It's through a, a third party, which is Patreon. So um, love them or hate them, it, I like having that third party there um, because I don't. You know, this is not this is not an opportunity for me. I don't like grifting. I would never be a grifter. I believe that you know I put integral content, integral work in this channel. And then of course my work outside of this channel and of course, you know, my sponsorships. So just be really, really, really careful. I'm personally never going to contact you and ask you to do like a private lesson with me. I'm never going to contact you and ask you or tell you that I had a dream about you or I've got some, some secret knowledge about you. I know that's what these scammers do a lot. And I just want you guys just to be very aware because again, have discernment. 
There's not, you know, if you lose your money to a scammer, even if it's under my name, there's not much, I can't do anything. I can't get you the money back. Most of these scammers live in other countries anyway. So there's absolutely nothing I can do to, to help you recover that money. So just be very, 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 very aware of this, you guys. And if you do get a weird message from, from me and you're not sure if it's from me, you are welcome to email me at esotericatlanta at gmail.com or ask me in the comment section before you respond to it. And I can let you know if that's actually really from me or not. Okay. I don't even, you guys, just so you know, like on Instagram, I hardly check my messages on Instagram. Um, I made a, a psychological choice to do that, a mental choice to do that when I first opened my, my channel because I was getting very overwhelmed with messages and I was getting some bad messages and I heard another, or not, I heard an uh, actor say something about just not checking the Instagram messages and I decided that I was going to take that advice and just keep my head clear myself of that. And so with that being said, you're, you know, unless you know me personally, um, if you know me personally, you're going to have my phone number. So, you know, you're never going to get messages from me on, on devices. Yeah. If anything, it's going to come through esoteric Atlanta at gmail.com. You know, it's not going to come through. I, I don't even know really how to check the messages on TikTok yet. So just be very, just be very careful. You guys just really have your discernment Times are tough right now for a lot of people. And so unfortunately, when this happens, we see people get desperate and we see that um, they start doing illegal stuff. You know, desperate times call for desperate measures. Just recently on Cold Beer Confessionals, it's a great channel, by the way. He, he's kind of like me in a lot of ways. Uh, he kind of questions a lot of stuff, even in the disclosure community. And there was just recently a big um, quote unquote Patriot channel that got found out to be an actual foreign entity that people were taking, were donating to monthly. So just be very, very careful, you guys, you know, just remember that there is such thing as infiltration. There always has been. And just be really, really, really careful. If something doesn't feel right, it probably isn't. Okay. All right. So I hope, I hope you guys are all good and you, you, you're safe and you know, but anyway, I will put my links to my new TikTok channel. I'm, I'm still, I'm still trying to figure out how to make the green screen videos. So just give me a few more days to like figure all that out and then I'll be hooking it up to my channel. But um, yeah, all down in the description box below. And if you're not following me on Instagram, that's there as well. And, um, and yeah, that's the only social media I have now guys. Okay. I have YouTube, Rumble, TikTok, and Instagram. That's it. I don't have Facebook anymore. I don't have Twitter anymore or X anymore. So if I ever reopen Facebook or X, I will let you guys know. But that's it. So TikTok, Instagram, YouTube, and Rumble. That's it. Okay. So all right, you guys. Well, go down into the description box below. And you'll see the link. And we'll see you over there.